Biden officials now believe COVID lab leak theory. A lab leak or a mistake, um, that was never discarded. Ready, Ted? Ready, Bill? Let's go back into history. Fauci dismisses lab as source of virus. Ignore the conspiracy theories. The conspiracy, the coronavirus was man-made in a lab in Wuhan, China. There is no reason to believe any of these conspiracy theories that it was leaked from the lab. A theory that's almost certainly not true. A conspiracy theory that the coronavirus originated inside a lab in China. Like it was a conspiracy of some kind. Lab wasn't source of virus. You can draw a line through it and say that it didn't happen. We know it didn't. The Wuhan lab conspiracy theory. Debunk conspiracy, conspiracy theory. theory. The fringe theory that the virus came from a lab in Wuhan, China. Scientists debunk lab theory. The conspiracy theory about COVID coming from a lab in Wuhan. Oh my God, coronavirus came from Wuhan. A conspiracy theory. Outright ridiculous conspiracy theories. Debunked bunkum. Scientists know. Experts have more than enough evidence to show. Pants on fire. Lab conspiracy theories debunk. Put it in the conspiracy theory bucket. Okay. One of the biggest crises out there now is the, in, the false information being circulated on social media about the virus. But the virus happened when our regular coronavirus married this other virus, made children, and then the rest is history. And I can tell you for sure it was not manufactured in a lab. Lab leak conspiracy theory. The conspiracy theory to foment xenophobia. Very destructive conspiracy theory. Conspiracists pushing misinformation. Conspiracy theories. That flurry of conspiracy theories. Prejudiced lab conspiracy theories. These conspiracy theories damage our real world. We don't need to invoke conspiracy theories. The theory is bunk. The idea that this escaped from a lab is pure baloney. Complete baloney. Widely debunked. Conspiracy theories run Rampant. Conspiracy theories that it somehow escaped the lab that was in Wuhan. I think that's unlikely. Scientists rule out the idea. Scientists condemning conspiracy theories. This conspiracy theory that the coronavirus originated in a lab. Conspiracy theories on the origins of the virus in the Wuhan lab, which of course are unfounded. A conspiracy theory that the coronavirus came from a lab. It's another false claim. The Wuhan China lab at the center of conspiracy theories. At the center of conspiracy theories. The target of conspiracy theories. The focus of conspiracy. The lab in Wuhan, China, that's been an object of conspiracy theories. At the center of conspiracy theories. Conspiracy theories. The Wuhan lab responding to conspiracy theories. There's no way that it could be leaked from the lab. So you're 100% confident there was no leak, no accident. I'm confident there's no leak. 100%. 100%. Wow. Oh. That's good enough for me. <laughs> Scientists worldwide agree that the virus occurred naturally. And the uh, most likely scenario is is uh, it occurred from, you know, bats in, in, the, in the marketplace. Bats were not sold at Wuhan wet markets. I don't think it's a vast international conspiracy. I think the bats got too close in the wet market. As soon as I heard there was a new pneumonia, I said, well, a new pneumonia, Wuhan, wet market. It was uh, from bat to human in a uh, illegal wildlife market. Came from bats. Most likely came from bats, yes. And came from bats in, a, in this wildlife market. Yes. Uh, she is very convinced, about 90% sure. Coronavirus most likely spread from a market in China, not from a lab in Wuhan. The growing consensus is that this virus came from a market in Wuhan, not from the lab. It's probably from a wet market in China. Most likely in a wildlife wet market. It was most likely a wet market in Wuhan where coronavirus originated. The source of this virus is the Chinese wet market. So likely probably wet markets. In the market. A wet market. Experts say the virus originated in this wet market. Market. The market, which uh, is most likely the origin of the virus. The wet market seems like the most likely source. The scientific consensus is that this came from a wet market. It began in a wet market. From a wet market. Most scientists believe China's wet market should be the focus. Wet markets that bring in animals that are next to bats in caves in wherever, who knows. One of the early, more plausible theories was that the wildlife wet market in Wuhan was where the virus first made its species jump from an animal a human. But none of the animals at the market tested positive for the virus. Several of the original cases did not have any contact with that food market. The virus went into that food market before it came out of that food market. Concerning comments from Senator Tom Cotton. Tom Cotton was playing a dangerous game with his coronavirus speculation. Just a few miles away from that food market is China's only biosafety level four super laboratory that researches human infectious diseases. Tom Cotton was being a deadly bobble-throated slapdick nutcase, just like the Soviet propagandists who tried to convince the world 
world that the CIA invented AIDS. We know that they were conducting very dangerous research into coronaviruses. Conspiracy theorist Tom Cotton flogs conspiracy theory. We don't know where it originated, but we do know that we have to get to the bottom of that. A coronavirus conspiracy theory that was already debunked. A thoroughly debunked theory. We don't know, again, where this virus originated. He's spreading conspiracy theories. It's so important that we at least ask the questions and get the evidence. Tom Cotton, the rational conspiracy monger. China continues to block our ability to ask those questions and get that evidence. Tom Cotton, conspiracy theories. We need to at least ask the question. Conspiracy theories pushed by Tom Cotton. China right now is not giving any evidence on that question. It's very harmful to stir up suspicion. It's very dangerous. Tom Cotton is one of the most dangerous and irresponsible people. This will create racial discrimination, xenophobia. This will create panic. We don't want to have a public panic. Tom Cotton is a fear-mongering conspiracy pusher. We want to err on the side of caution. Tom Cotton spreading debunked rumors. So much is unknown. Cotton has been criticized for giving just the whiff of credibility to a conspiracy theory. Fringe theory. Conspiracy theory. Fringe theory that the coronavirus is man-made. Ryan, what's the best way to sift through all these myths out there on social media and avoid the misinformation? Well, Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg teamed up with Fauci to decide what information <laughs> counts as disinformation. Facebook then censored the lab leak theory. Both scientists and the U.S. intelligence community agree that this coronavirus was not man-made. The virus was not, not, not man-made. That is not a possibility. It didn't come from a lab. This was not made by men. It was too clunky weird. The virus was not man-made. It's not man-made. Again, scientists are convinced that this is not man-made. It was not man-made. COVID-19 was not man-made. This virus definitely wasn't man-made. U.S. intelligence said that COVID-19 is not man-made. The WHO says the virus could not be man-made. It's not man-made. Dr. Anthony Fauci is shooting down theories that the coronavirus was man-made. The conspiracy theories suggesting the coronavirus was man-made. It is very, very strongly leaning towards this could not have been artificially or deliberately manipulated. It was not man-made or genetically modified. Not man-made or genetically modified. Not man-made or genetically modified. Wide scientific consensus that the COVID-19 virus was not man-made or genetically modified. It was not man-made or genetically modified. The intelligence community this morning saying that they did not believe the coronavirus was man-made or genetically modified. But it is not, not man-made man -made or, or genetically modified. Scientific consensus that COVID-19 virus was not man-made or genetically modified. COVID-19 was not man-made or genetically modified. Not man-made or genetically modified. The virus was not, not man-made man -made or genetically modified. modified. Very strongly supported by scientific evidence that it was not deliberately media, uh, 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 mutated and deliberately changed. But we now know from emails unredacted that Dr. Fauci was warned early on by top scientists that the virus likely came from a lab leak and looked genetically manipulated. No way. Yes way, Ted! The foreign ministry in China said that those were conspiracy theories. The WHO team ruled out a lab accident or leak as a possible driver for the pandemic. They're saying don't waste any more time and effort on that. It's simply not true. Extremely unlikely. Conspiracy theories. Conspiracies have no grounds. Researchers propose a further investigation into every area except the lab leak report. The WHO team says that it will no longer pursue research into the lab leak theory. So that's over. Uh, there was a premature push to, um, uh, you know, reduce one of the uh, options like the lab theory. I was a lab technician myself and I have worked in the lab and lab accidents happen. It's common. I have seen it happening. And I had, I myself had errors. So it can, it can happen. And we need information, direct information on what the situation of these labs was before and at the start of the pandemic.